Master, we just wanted to share about an artist. Um, his name is Ricardo Colon, who, is, who said um, online, I saw a huge canopy of angels over the White House. Yes. And he immediately went home and began to pray again for the president. He says, I saw these four huge angels hovering over our president, Trump. It's, it's just on internet, right? Yes. yes. Wow. Bless him, bless him, bless him. Yeah. And I'm telling you one secret. President Trump has angels and Vice President Pence also has angels. Wow. Yeah, yeah. There's a good team, good work. President Trump's team are clean and good. Okay? Yes, yes. 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 Yeah, yeah. And you know what we have talked about uh, lately or some a message that we give, it does have effect. Today I saw journalists wrote very defensively for President Trump. Yes. Oh. And John Voight, voice again. Oh. <laughs> and they said President Trump is the only one who can save America. Wow. <laughs> who can save our nation now. <laughs> Before he didn't say the only one. <laughs> He is good. I, I really pray that he sits there another four years. Yes, yes, yes. Because the other party might undo everything that President Trump has done. Yes. yes. And four more years later to begin again is hard, okay? Yes, if if he can even win or he can begin again. Yes, yes, yes. So scary this world and this, oh my God. That's why ever since President Trump is in office, they power on him nonstop. They never let him have a break or to to organize a state affair and things like that. They continue to beat him up. Yes, yes Master. This is a lot of protection for him, otherwise he would have been doomed. Oh. You know, like broken down or any other thing would happen to him. That he could not even do any state affairs. Uh, well, okay, huh? Yes, yes, yes Master. Master. Master, on November 3rd, Sadhu Sundar Selvaraj had a video on YouTube saying that President Trump is God's chosen candidate. He also mentioned the angels around President Trump and that he needs to be re-elected to fulfill the covenant he made with God. Yeah. Wow. Who is this Sadhu? Is he famous? I'm actually not sure, Master. I, know, I, I think he's in India. No matter what, he's a sadhu, he won't tell lies. Because they keep the precept of not lying, because if they lie, they, they, they know the, the, the consequences. Yes, yeah. yes. And what for he lies about this? Because it's not his president, and it's not his land. You know, America is not, it's not his. Yes, Master. There are hordes of journalists, reporters, and uh, politicians or non-politicians, they are all pounding on President Trump all these years, is he so whoever uh, uh, side with President Trump must really know the risk, yeah? Yes, yes. Of being maybe <laughs> treated the same way. I am aware of that, but I have to say it, okay? You see, I should have said it long ago, I just hesitated. Yeah, I was uh, soft-spoken all these conferences before, yeah? What I told you about Mr. Trump, it's just recently because I heard that he permitted the transition, so that's why I have to uh, speak more clearly, okay? Yes, yes Master. Master. More definitely. Because the official who is responsible for the transition fund, she has been howled, you know, or harassed, so she just had to do it, and President Trump has to relent for her safety and peace. Yes, yes Master. Master. They would not uh, let it be. He should be re-elected. Now, at least four more years for him to catch up yes, yes. and to do all other jobs that he has not done. In the world, there are not just these two or three people. They just don't say it, but there are uh, at least 90 people who saw uh, angels around President Trump. Wow. Not just me or Mr. Void or the, the, the monks in India. Yes, Master. Or, or oh. whoever that Carlos is, yeah? Mm. Not just them. There are 90-something more people who saw him. Wow. Wow. 
So we are not just talking without proof. Eh? Many other people see them. Yes, 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 it's just that this kind of proof, you, you, you just have to lie stack an oath with the Bible that you tell the truth. That's all. Otherwise, it's not like a photograph. You can show it to anybody. Okay? Yes, yes, yes Master. <laughs> Thank you, Master. Thank you, Master. Could Master please tell us what is that covenant between God and President Trump? <laughs> that's he has to make peace. Ah. Yes, that's his uh, his job, his mission. Okay. Ah. Mm. You can see it very well. More nations are coming to peace, also with Israel. That means peace with America and the world. Yes, Master. Mm. Because it's mediated by American government, by President Trump. I still pray for him every day, whenever I'm not working. I mean, between the jobs, yeah? Yes, yes, yes Master. Or at night, of course, when I meditate. I cannot keep repeating it, but I just hope that everything goes well. Yes, yes Master. Imagine a machine who has a software, you can er erase it, you can delete the, the documents, and you can change the documents, and you can completely erase it out of sight. Oh. Yeah, if with the software nowadays, you know, yes. people can do many things with the software, right? Yes, yes Master. Yeah. Can you guys do that? If you send something to the, to the other party's telephone, and you can erase it from your own phone? I'm not sure, Master. No, we're not sure. Ah, uh, that guy, maybe he's a computer geek. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, some special people can do that. One of your sisters, she also knows many things about computer safety and all that. And she had told me many things that I feel, you know, my eyes are quite open. Yeah, my wisdom eye open already, but my physical eyes also open. Say, so, wow, huh? Really? That's unsafe? That's not safe? That is safe? You can do that? Uh, yeah. Some people know more advanced computer or, or software technology than you do. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Yeah, I'm sorry you are not uh, maybe a software geek, but some people are, huh? No? Okay. Yes, Master. Mm -hmm. Uh, that's it? That's your, all your question now? Yes, that's all, Master. Uh, okay. If any more explanation needed, you know, to extend uh, your knowledge about any of your question or my answer, you let me know, okay? Think about it. Yeah. Okay, Master. And now I want to tell you some other thing. Hmm? Uh, yes, you, Master. Thank you, Master. Yeah. You asked me uh, if my meditation helps, yeah? Yes, yes. yes Master. It helps in many ways, of course. It helps all our planet will not be destroyed or flung into into the black hole. Oh. Are you seen the, the news that the black hole has uh, made a noodle out of the star? Yes, yes Master. Okay, this is a real thing, huh? Wow. Because this star has been doing evil deeds, so it's a punishment. Oh. The star is not just a star, alone one person or one being, just like our planet is like a star also. But many billions of beings in it, you know? Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, the same, they, they have discovered the six galaxies within one of the, the, the how do you say, black holes. That is because uh, the punishment, black hole is hell. Oh. It's a physical, visible hell. Oh. Yes, Master. And anyone, any planet, any star, any uh, uh, celestial body, if it has done anything badly and it accumulates too heavy, too long, then it will go there oh. to receive the retribution. Oh. And that's why they discover six galaxies in there. These galaxies are the bad ones. Yes, Master. And if our planet is not careful enough, or doesn't have enough blessing and protection, is going to fly, or I say sucked into the black hole. Oh, wow. One of the black holes that are nearby us. Let me check it again if I have it. Because one of the black holes is in the middle of the Milky Way. That's what the scientists say. Well, I have to tell you in scientific terms, because otherwise you don't believe me. What is very near... It's 2,000 uh, light years uh, closer than they thought before. Yes, yeah, but very close. When you hear that 2,000 light years is nothing. Yes, yes. yes. And, and when karma is up, it will suck it in there. 
Mm. Doesn't matter how far. So that's what happened to any planet or star who doesn't behave according to universal law. That's why the Earth people should worry, okay? Yes, Master. It's not about how, how far the distance or how near the distance. The black hole will make, uh, you know, noodles out of our planet. We shed it like a, like a, how you say, the uh, paper shredding machine. Okay. Uh, well, in no time. Yes, Master. Mm-hmm. And just suck it in there, yeah. I don't know how long. It depends. The way we are warring with each other and killing billions, trillions of animals every year like this, it doesn't take long to, to have the same fate at that star that you saw on Internet. Okay? Yes, Master. Yeah, it won't take long. You see, any planet or any galaxy that has similar energy as the black hole's energy, then sooner or later the planet or the stars will gravitate toward the black hole and then will be swallowed up in no time. The black hole is pure negative. Thus, any star or any planet where all the beings inside have not done anything good, just do bad deeds until the energy add up, add up, add up, build up, build up until it's so heavy, become so much negative atmosphere, then then it will gravitate toward one of these black holes and be swallowed up in it. Yes, Mr. Yes, Mr. It's, it's fantastic already that the scientists already can see it for millions of light years away. But of course, there are things, there are activities within the black holes that no one can see, even the psychics, because this is all covered. Wow. If you can see it, you might hurt yourself even. Yes, yes, yes. yes, yes. Mostly no one can go there except the bad beings, evil beings. And some of these um, activities are described in the Buddhist Sutra called Kristigaba Sutra, yeah? Earth Store Bodhisattva Sutra. These activities of hells and suffering and pain and sorrow, indescribable pain and suffering, endless suffering, are described in the Kristigaba Sutra. And there are more, not just that. But of course, we cannot see them with our naked eyes. Even with the scientist's best telescope. I feel so sorry for all beings on this planet that they don't understand anything about the mechanism of hell, that how near they can be to any hell-like existence by being ignorant, by doing all kinds of things that according to heavens and universal law are unfit, are degrading, are cruel, or coarse, or inhumane. I don't know how else to warn humans. I can only meditate and pray. I hope one day we will return to our own benevolent nature inherent within all humans and all beings so that we don't ever know the world suffering, let alone suffer ourselves. May God bless us all. Amen. Yes, 